Hi everyone, this is Yuri from Capcom and here is your first batch of free DLC for Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate, including our weapon design contest winners, a brand new selection of episode quests, and Link's outfit and weapons from the Legend of Zelda series. Starting on March 6th, we will be offering you all new quests and bonus content for free on the first Friday of every month for the next several months. Let's start up with your low rank quests. Hunt these 12 Remobra in the arena and you'll get crafting materials for a fan club jacket, a stylish rider jacket, and matching black leather chaps. Taking on this Darren Moran will give you special tickets which you can use to forge alternate EX versions of its sword and shield, longsword, and switch axe. As a special collaboration with Universal Studios Japan, you get to hunt not one but two frenzied Rathlos for a fancy suit of armor, a top hat, and a matching longsword. The Poogie King quest demands you capture, not kill, a Yunkut Ku. Fulfill this request and you get to craft the Emperor's Speech Hunting Horn, one of the winners of our weapon design contest. Simply adorable. Challenge Quest 1 also comes with this pack. It tasks you with hunting a Kechawacha and a Rathian while offering the choice between a hammer, a switch axe, dual blades, a bow, or a heavy bow gun. In Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate, we're introducing a brand new line of quests called Episode Quests. These will have you taking requests from NPCs from previous games in the series with fun little twists. So make sure you read the quest requirements. Bet you never fought a Seregius on a boat, huh? Completing this first selection will get you Yukumo tickets, which you can use to craft a variety of pieces of equipment for you or your trusty Palico. Now on to high rank quests. The long-awaited Legend of Zelda collaboration gear is finally here, but you'll have to work for it. Take on a Thunderous Trio to get the Triforce and craft Link's hero armor. And take down a mighty Akantor for the Goddess's Fire, which will allow you to craft the hero's sword and the hero's bow. Now if you like classic metal-based armor sets, consider the quest Might and Melody. Clearing out this Najarala and Tetsukabra allows you to craft the EX Ingot armor. Quick tip for this one, Divide and Conquer. Fans of Steampunk should definitely sign up for the quest A Lost Civilization. This tiny Tetsukabra actually holds the blueprints for the other winner of our weapon design contest, the Clockwork Insect Glaive. Awesome gear indeed, am I right? Those up for a challenge should consider taking on a Gold Rathian on the quest Royal Restoration or a Silver Rathalos on Tower of Trouble. Good luck! Again, all this content comes to you for free on the first Friday of every month. Check again in April for more awesome quests and equipment. In the meantime, happy hunting.